Sustainable365.com. We're here with Robert Simmons of Sustainable Garden Supply, Incorporated. Uh, take it away. Tell us a little bit about this really cool tower system you have for, uh, for planting. Okay. Basically, we use the science of aeroponics. What that means is, is the plant root system is suspended in the air. When the, when the timer comes on, the pump comes on, and it introduces water and food to the root system. The balance of that, what's not taken up by the plant at that time, is returned back to the reservoir. So it's a recirculating closed loop system. This particular system was designed with my mom in mind. She can't bend over and do the weeding and gardening like she likes to do. So with a vertical system, that gave her a stand-up garden. You get into the family garden series, this has 30 plant sites per tower. A two-tower system will give you 60 plant sites. If you want to increase the garden, you cut the PVC and add a tower. Some of the things that we've grown are yard-long beans, peppers, kohlrabi, butternut squash, all types of basil, rosemary. If you want to increase your garden, cut the tower, cut the PVC, and add towers. This is my daughter with about a three and a half foot head of lettuce. At four years old, she knows the difference between daddy's broccoli and store-bought food. She'll actually ask my wife if those are daddy's vegetables. When you can teach, when you can get a four-year-old to do that, that's something you don't teach. That's something that they know. It's a recyclable plastic. Absolutely. It's a food-grade plastic. And what, what you've got with that wall thickness is something that's going to last a long time. Start your plant in soil. Take it out. When it gets about that tall, rinse it off. Put it in the basket. Put the cover back on it. And, you're, and now you've transplanted your garden. Very fast, very efficient, very small, and very clean. This type of gardening, you can pick some lettuce today, get a couple of tomatoes, a cucumber, and a bell pepper. What this means is, three or four days later, you'll go back to your garden, get some more lettuce, another couple of ripe tomatoes, another cucumber, and some more bell peppers. So you always have a fresh food supply. For commercial applications, what we've done is we've done a 12-foot tower. This gives you 60 plant sites per three square feet on the ground. So it's quite possible to have a large garden in a small space, grow clean food, and not put chemicals in the earth. That's wonderful. Is there a website people can check out to order their own? Absolutely. www.sustainablegardensupply.com Thank you so much for talking with us today. Thank you, sir. Appreciate your time. Cool. that all that is, is a cutting. And this root system has developed from that in three and a half weeks. If this plant was growing in the ground, it would have a root system about like that. Since the root system is the equivalent of the mouth of the plant, that's why our plants grow 45% faster, have so much better taste, and much better aromatic. This is called an aromatic system? Aeroponic. Aeroponic system Correct. versus a hydroponic, which Correct. is? Hydroponic, the root system is usually suspended in a fluid. So what you get there is stem rot and root rot from all the fungus. Otherwise, another type of hydroponic system uses a growing medium that's pumped in from the top. And when you, in our system, we water each plant site at the same time. So the plants are fed and watered equally throughout the system. In hydroponic systems that are a straight flow through system, you get a large plant in the top that has plenty of water and food, and the small, and then it goes smaller as it goes down. Not only that, you're pumping straight through, so you're still putting the chemicals back in the earth. It's not necessary to do that. Plants need four basic elements. They need food, water, light, and oxygen. We don't need a list of chemicals that we can't pronounce, okay? And this way does it clean, efficient, and recycles. How much does a unit like this go for? A single tower system until December 1st, including the meters, the fertilizer, aqua shield, which is a liquid compost, so we put beneficial bugs in the, in the reservoir. That system is $5.99 until December 1st. That's a pretty good price. We realize that this is a tough economy and it's hard for everybody. What we do want to do is give them the opportunity to get good fresh food. If you spend $10 a week on vegetables, in one year's time you have your money back on this system. People spend far more than that. On Absolutely. These days. And when you look at the wall thickness, the construction on this system, this has got a quarter inch wall thickness of food grade plastic. It's going to last you a while. Absolutely. So you've got quality, you've got a, a product that's going to be long-lasting, beneficial for us and the planet. That's good.